Well, the tragic death of an Olympic sprinter is bringing maternal mortality into the forefront. Doctors now say 32 year old Tori Bowie, who won gold in the Rio Olympics, died due to childbirth. It's a pressing issue in our community and one group has an even higher risk. Action News race and culture reporter Taronda Thomas tells us more. I'm on your time, girl. Actually, Xiomara Gittens is on the baby's time. You know the type of birth you want. Coaching a soon-to-be mom over the phone before meeting her at the hospital as a doula and owner of the Purple Purpose in Marlton. Providing emotional, physical, and spiritual support. It's a personal cause for her. I had a traumatic birth experience myself. Which is why it was heartbreaking to hear the news of Olympic gold medalist Tori Bowie. New autopsy results reveal she died from complications of childbirth. I get emotional a lot because it's like, the, you are literally a lot of black women are losing their life. On May 2nd, Bowie was found in bed eight months pregnant with signs of respiratory distress and eclampsia. Eclampsia is something that is pretty rare and that it is a sudden spike in your blood pressure that can cause um, seizures, that can cause like, a big embolism. Dr. Asta Mehta is director of Philadelphia's Maternal Mortality Review Committee, which works to prevent tragic deaths like Bowie's. They happen more than we think that they do, um, and they're always so tragic and sad, especially young people that are healthy and shouldn't be dying. Black women have the highest maternal mortality in the U.S. In Philadelphia, they make up 43 percent of the births, but 73 percent of pregnancy-related deaths. There are 20 maternal deaths for every 100,000 births in the city. That's about 15 percent higher than the national average. It's one thing to know your data. It's quite another thing to know your data and respond to it. It's why Gittins does what she can, hoping to help save lives while bringing life into the world. Ultimately reach our goal, which is a healthy mom and a healthy baby. The Philadelphia Maternal Mortality Review Committee will release its latest findings at the end of this year. In the meantime, here at Gittin's office, she offers free classes for moms and dads-to-be. We have information on 6abc.com. In Marlton, New Jersey, Taronda Thomas, Channel 6 Action News.